That's a fun question. People always say, what in the world do you do? <laughs> you know, when the park is closed. Do you take vacation? We actually get busier in the off season than we are in our regular, you know, daily occurrence of delivering the day with excellence because of all of the work that happens in the off season to keep our brand at its highest level. Our lightning rod attraction is getting an entirely brand new track. And we really took a hard look at what we could do to make this ride run consistently. It's gonna be a really smooth and repeatable experience. So that's gonna be a huge accomplishment for our maintenance and attractions teams. I can't wait to show the public what it's gonna be like. One of the most iconic structures that we have on property and one of the most unique places is the chapel. And we're giving the church a brand new facelift, a brand new roof structure, and repaired all of the footers for the church. And it's gonna get a new paint job. And I think we're gonna have it looking very pretty for the 2021 season. Hickory House is one of our famous barbecue places on property. And it was right across the street from the American Eagle Foundation. But it was always really difficult to be able to see the eagles and enjoy a meal from the Hickory House. So we're transplanting the blacksmith shop down to the old pottery barn and giving them a brand new environment to work from. It's gonna be able to be more interactive for the guests to be able to see our craftsmen's firsthand. And we're having a new dining area for the Hickory House that's gonna provide a lot more comfortable you know, seating for our guests enjoying themselves at the Hickory House. You'll notice that there's a whole brand new flooring system at Front Porch Cafe that we put in to make it a lot easier for our guests to get in and out of that building in a more comfortable way. The flower and food, it's an amazing, immersive experience to see. One of the fun elements that we're adding into it is a chalk experience, not only for you know the kids that are arriving, but we're gonna have some chalk artists that are gonna be you know, doing some art along the sidewalks. The entertainment program that's coming up in the flower and food, we're theming it to the melodies of spring. Think of it as very inspirational music and lots of live acts to support you know, that umbrella theme. We're not only gonna be activating our indoor theaters again, but we're also not gonna lose what we gained with our outdoor entertainment venues. On March the 13th, we get to open our 2021 season. So I'm really looking forward to it. I know our entire team is really excited about welcoming everyone to the Dollywood Parks and Resorts.